Hi guys. Hey guys. You probably know us from somewhere else. <laughs> yep. We're the, uh, the Tabletop Battle guys. This is Martin. And this is Sven. And today we're actually doing a video for Boweda War Games for their official 148 Tactic channel. Yes sir. This channel. This channel that you're watching right now. Um, and the reason is, of course, that we have been working with the creator of 148 Tactic. We have been working with him for over half a year. Yes, sir. Close to a year soon. Uh, we, you know, we love 148 Tactic. We have helped play test things. We will get back to that um, and show you some stuff that is coming. And you know, this is a channel for news and unboxings and all cool stuff. You know. Be the first to know what's coming for 148 tactic yeah hopefully you will find it here um, so we will show you later in the video some cool stuff uh, but you know just so you know why are we here we help uh, Boyana war games um, and we have time to make videos yeah and we have time for you which Claudio he is you know bogged down in making all the cool new stuff that you will love okay so first off uh, what is on the channel? Oh, it's Fallschirmjägers, man. Fallschirmjägers. Yes, sir. Yeah, actually, that is the first upcoming release now. It's going to come out. It was supposed to come out in uh, it, December, but it was delayed a little bit, so it will come out now in January. As you see this, it probably will already have come out. Possibly. Yeah. Because the the cover art was uh, delayed at the printer, so but now it was on the way, so I think the boxes will start shipping, you know, as we speak. Yeah. Actually, uh, but you have also seen in the intro to the video, you also saw some spinning around guy. Yes, sir. And what was that? Is that the one hundred and first uh, yeah. guy? Yeah. Because there's some expansions for the one hundred and first airborne, which was yes, in the starter set as well as for the German Volksgrenadiers. So first up we got the... Uh, the Chester Brooks. Chester Brooks, he is a, he is a sniper. Yes sir, finally, finally is. a dedicated sniper. And what do you think? Do you think he will have five dice, same as Rupert? I think he's gonna have uh, the five dice at long range, and with an aim of course, and a maximum of maybe four or even three at short range. But you know, yeah, it's a Springfield. He has a Springfield. It's it's um, it's uh, what's it called? Bolt action. So yeah. it will only have one shot. Yeah, one shot. So that's Chester Brooks. He's going to be a sniper. Yeah, that's something you as dedicated needs. sniper. Okay. But what about Ger Ger Gerhardt? Gerhardt. <laughs> How do you say that? Gerhardt. Yeah. Yeah. Gerhardt. Uh, Gerhardt uh, Kegler. Yeah. Kegler. Kegler. We have, well, you have also seen the sculpt now. Uh, he's running with this STG 44, kind of so, like tactical moving and bow, bow, bow. It's a really cool pulse on that model. Very cool pulse. Um, it's kind of like uh, Christian Krieger, Christian Krieger yeah. only actually aiming. Yes, sir. I think he's gonna be a lot like Christian uh, when you're playing, uh, although I hope he's got a better hand to hand value. Yeah, because that's what the Germans lack at, yeah. the, at this moment. So I don't know how the Falschirmjägers are going to be. Falsch they're going to be awesome. Falschirmjägers oh. will have awesome hand-to-hand -hand combat, no worries. But the uh, the guard is also in the Falschirmjägers, so he is sort of like a, a second-hand troop. If you, <laughs> uh, yeah. So probably it's going to be a lot like Christian. Maybe without as big a um, opportunity fire yeah, because range, range as Christian has, because he has three inches, yeah. Maybe that's going to be reduced to two, and he's going to get a, hopefully, a higher hand-to-hand -hand value. Yeah, or, or maybe I five guess. actions. Five actions, that would be powerful on the STG-44. Yes, sir. Or a better move and shoot. Or a better move and shoot. We can only we can only we guess. Know. We don't know. The, the the stats are hidden secrets as they should be. Yep. Uh, but you've seen the sculpt. It's very cool. Uh, we're looking forward to that. It's going to be an addition for the twenty sixth folks and the theirs. Yes, sir. So that means the total for them will be uh, four models each, in addition to the starter set. Yeah. Uh, but there's also. Tom Sheridan. Yes, sir. And what the... is he armed with? Oh, he's armed with a combat shotgun. <laughs> shotgun. <laughs> and we've been speculating a lot. Yeah. 
I'm thinking he's gonna have four dice at short range and he's not gonna have long range. Yeah. Something like that. A and move and shoot. And an insane hand to hand value. Like using the shotgun? Yeah. I don't know. Hopefully. Move and <laughs> shoot. He should have. Yeah. Move and shoot should be something with him. Uh, so Tom Sheraton with the shotgun, that's going to be cool. I really look forward to him. And that, you know, you can't buy him. It's a special edition. Ooh, limited character. edition. Yeah. yeah. Only for events. Yes, and sir. And we're going to be handing out a couple of those um, yeah, next, next month. Speaking of events, in February the 22nd to 23rd. Yes, sir. In Stoke on Trent. Two day event. Two day event. It's going to be the biggest 148 tactic event we've held so far. It's going to be the biggest 148 tactic event in the world so far. Between 20 and 30 players. So we're also helping with that. Yeah, and there's a lot of other people helping as well. We got some the terrain uh, producers. Oh, yeah, we got yeah. Sarissa is going to chip in. Uh, Steve Perry of uh, of uh, Rubicon models. Uh, he's helping organize uh, as long uh, as as well as Aaron Kill. Yeah, I think I said it right. Sorry if I didn't. Um, uh, and there, there, there's, there's a lot of people. There's a lot of people. It's gonna be cool. It's awesome goodie bag with uh, you get the free special ed character. Goodie bag is free. Free. So special ed character only in events. So if you live in the UK, please check out. I will leave a link, uh, you know, below uh, the official tournaments group for 148 tactic. Uh, there will be a very very nice uh, building. MDF building, yes, sir. Made by uh, Sarissa or Dark Ops, but they have been purchased by Sarissa. Uh, it's a two-story building. Yeah. Very very cool. You can remove the roof and yeah. play inside the house, and yeah, you can play inside your house. <laughs> it's called the Boulangerie, um, and there's also going to be some extra cards, some new cards not released yet. Yes, there's sir. going to be 148 token. Uh, probably some more free stuff that will end up there. Um, discount codes for Deep Cut Studio, I think. Yeah. And speaking about Discount uh, Studio, no, Deep, Deep Cut, Cut Studio. Discount Studios. <laughs> Deep Cut Studio. <laughs> they're they're also sponsoring some great prizes this yeah, year. Yeah, yeah, because you can win in this tournament. Of course, you can win one uh, free of choice starter set mm -hmm. for the first, second, and third place. Yes, sir. So that's three starter sets divided between the three first places, as well as the player number one also gets a three by three mat, mouse pad mat by Deep Cut Studio. Yeah, and that's sweet. That is sweet. That's uh, that's a lot of value right there. I think we're close to a hundred euros. Yep. In value. In prices for no, uh, for, for first number place. one. Yeah. And that's going to be excluding the goodie bag. And that's going to be us. Because we're going. Yeah. And we're going to play. Ah, um, okay, so that's that's a little bit about the tournament. So if you're in the UK, please check it out. Yes, sir. Uh, apart from that, other stuff. Other stuff yet to come. That's it's got a, a bunch of Kickstarter stuff yet to come. Yeah, because, you know, 148 Tactic was initiated in 2017. As you all know, it was the follow-up to 148 Combat. Yeah. Uh, so a revised edition of that, if you please. Um, and there was a Kickstarter which had uh, close to 200 backers and uh, there are still some things to come out. We have gotten, you know, the starter sets, we have seen Falsum yeah. Jaegers are coming now, uh, you have gotten all the extra characters, there's yeah. six in total. And then we spoke about the guys that you saw uh, yeah, on the, the guys video. That are coming. The guys that we talked about, uh, the guy with the assault rifle and the sniper for the US. Yes, sir. Uh, but there's going to be more. Uh, the Germans will also get a, a grenadier with Panzerfaust. Yes, sir. Why would he need a Panzerfaust? Well, well, we'll get back to that later. We'll get back to that <laughs> but later. But of course, to destroy vehicles. I guess that's what you use them for. But you can also use them against infantry because they have a blast radius. I guess, I don't know. Maybe this is going to be sort of like a more precise uh, blast weapon than the frag grenades. I Something don't know. like that. Possibly. We'll see. Ignore, we don't know. Maybe it's ignoring some cover. You can shoot it through walls. I don't know. Maybe. We don't know. 
This is pure speculation on our part, but of course it was mainly used for taking out armored targets. Yes, sir. As we will get back to. Yep. Is there anything else that's not finished in Kickstarter? Ooh, I'm gonna have to read on the thingy. Can you see the thingy? Yeah, I can. There's the the reinforcements, guys. Just are are we on that? Yeah. Yeah, there's reinforcements cards. There are. But you, you guys have probably already seen the reinforcement cards from um, 148 Combat. Yeah. Uh, if, if you haven't, just check them out. They're online somewhere. But reinforcements, they totally change the way you play the game. Because you pay a cheap price and Five. you get two models mm -hmm. for the price of one. But they die. Yeah, they don't have a wound immediately. inside. They die immediately. So, say they for instance have. you use the... There's a submachine gun side and a rifle side yeah. on the basic reinforcements card. If you use the uh, the uh, submachine gun side, mm -hmm. uh, uh, running forward, you run them in, you do the job, and you're exposed to crossfire and you die, then you get the rifleman that enters play mm -hmm. on your table edge. On your table edge. So you have him to snipe stuff, or if you want to snipe early, you can use the rifleman first, first and then and then enter. Otto Jr. Otto Jr. <laughs> so, but one hit, they're dead, but then you bring in the next. That's yeah. that's the reinforcement. And that was originally the idea yeah. for 148 Tactic. But we can now share with you thanks, 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 thanks to mm -hmm. Table of Battle. Us guys. Yeah, you're welcome. There's going to be. You. Go. You're going to have cards for each of the models. Yeah. In addition to the reinforcements card. So you're gonna get a uh, character package with two characters inside and three cards. So you get a named submachine gun guy, you get a named rifle guy, and you get, get one generic card for reinforcements. Usable on both sides for reinforcements. And yeah. that's all thanks to us. High five. And that's so nice. how we want to play the game, because we want to have cards, we want to have lots of models to choose from, we want to have possibilities. Because yeah. we love the game, we love to build our armies and build our squads and try yeah. new things, new and tactics. One of the things the, the US players are talking about these days are, is that you don't really have that many characters compared to the Germans. The Germans have a lot more because you can, well now you probably won't. But before <laughs> before we the, started these releases, yeah, yeah, you could get the 148 Combat Germans. Mm -hmm. uh, so that was eight there, and then now you get the Falschmeiers. So yeah. that's four more plus the seven you got from the starter. So that's fifteen, twenty-one, no, nineteen. Yeah, and the. 19 Germans. The US got the special edition Tom Sheridan. Yeah, so that's eight. So, yeah. Yeah. But the cool thing is. There is a another Kickstarter coming, though. There's another Kickstarter coming. We, but we're going to come back to that later when we're talking about the Kickstarters yet to come. Yeah, Kickstarters yet to come because part of what is coming is the US Army, uh, what's it called? 28th Infantry Division. It's a okay. starter set with four models, yeah. as you normal. It comes with terrain pieces and all that. Uh, you're gonna have a submachine gun guy, yes, probably sir. be your NCO. Yeah. You're gonna have a BAR guy. Yeah. And BAR, it's a very good weapon. That's very brutal. Brutal. It got two long range, two dice short range. Yeah. It can move and shoot. I don't know how far it will be for this character, but yeah, but the, the guy, other guy we already have has can move three and inches, yeah. and you can aim it as well. And you have two shots. So it's very good. Uh, and then you got a guy with a rifle. Yeah. And, and you got another guy with a rifle. And the M7 uh, grenade, rifle launcher. grenade launcher thing. What? Yeah. So that's rifle grenade probably launcher. Probably going to be their answer to the Panzerfaust. Probably. For taking out vehicles, maybe, or to have some blast if you got got guys huddled up behind yes. some sandbags. Probably a long may, range may, grenade, may, maybe. Maybe, yeah. Of course. Yeah. It, it's going to be a long range grenade, it won't have, but it did need to have some scatter because it wasn't that accurate. It wasn't. But you can probably but may, shoot maybe, it. And this is all maybe. Stuff. Maybe, we don't know. Because now you have the, the range for the frag grenades on the accurate of five inches. Mm -hmm. Throw it five inches, yeah. Maybe it's like a frag grenade with ten? a ten inch range. Probably. 
accurately yeah. and up to 15, 15 with scatter. scatter. Yeah. Maybe. Sounds reasonable. Because that's got the blast radius to allow it to scatter and still damage people. Mm. So it's sort of precise at long range. And while we're <laughs> speaking of US and what they're going to have, they're yeah. also going to have a bazooka team. I know! And what do you need to stop a bazooka team? You need machine guns. And who's getting a machine gun team? The Germans are! MG-34 <laughs> machine gun team! But and that's with two guys. Bazooka one. team, grenade launchers, machine gun team, Panzerfaust. This is starting to sound like Achtung Panzer. What is Achtung Panzer? Oh, it's uh, it's a thing our friend at... Um, Baueda? Baueda. Uh, I don't know how to say it. Bauda? Bauda? Baueda? Baueda. I'm sorry. 140 attack team. He's been working on sort of like an armored vehicle project. Yeah. We've been playtesting this a bit. Where you got jeeps, you got 50 cals, you got... Heavy weapons, got tanks. Tanks. It's uh, very fun. It's very fun. <laughs> mines? Didn't we make yeah. the rules for mines? Yeah, for land mines. We don't know yeah. if it's gonna be there, but, <laughs> no, but we pitched in our we, idea we, anyway. Yeah. Uh, but that is something that's uh, due any time, really. I think January, February, you're gonna see Achtung Panzer. Yeah. As, or as see more talk about it. Yeah. yeah. Expansion book where you will get rules for vehicles and heavy weapons, anti-tank rifles, yes sir, uh, machine guns, you know, uh, all those cool but things. I'm sort of psyched to know the rules in the uh, how do you say Lanzarote? Uh, no, not the Lanzarote. <laughs> how do you say it? It's uh, Lanzarath. Lanzarath, the Lanzarath Ridge. It's the expansion where you get the um, the uh, uh, M7. The 50 cal. And the grenade launcher, right? You get a German with a grenade launcher. You get a German with a grenade launcher. Yes. We didn't talk about this yet. No. <laughs> it's also one of the it's things... It's one of the scenario packs yet to come. Yeah, because you have seen the race for fuel scenario pack. Yeah. Uh, there's one more left from the Kickstarter, which is uh, the Lance Red Ridge one, where you have... It was a battle... A battle? Battle? Battle. It was a battle where uh, the US held off 500 German uh, Fallschirmjäger. Yeah. Or at least... 500 German troops, uh, and they uh, applied, you know, a armored uh, jeep with a 50 cal. Uh, there was uh, a German with a rifle grenade. This is actually historical fact. Yeah, because there was one German who managed to sneak, <laughs> sneak, sneak up and launched his rifle grenade thing inside Took out the, the pillbox. Pill yeah, uh, and these terrain pieces are actually included: the jeep, the pillbox, yeah. uh, a a cottage or a hut which was used yeah. as an observation post. That scenario uh, kit is going to be I'm awesome. Really looking forward to this With pillbox three, thing. Three new characters. With three unique characters in it, yeah. And once again, uh, two of the characters were always going to be there. One yeah. for the US and one for the German Falcon Air. And there was going to be a crew. The crew for the 50 cal is actually now going to have their own card. That was not the intention. Good. So they're gonna have so now. It's gonna be cards. You can you can use much more. Well, you have you have lots more options, yeah. and that's what we want. That's what we love. The pillbox. You like pillboxes? I love the pillboxes because now we only have these. You only have these. You you got these donut terrain things, and they're they're cute. Oh, you know what's coming for in the one man cover? You know what's coming in the Falschmeier structure? No, uh, a wall section. It's a wall section. It's new. A wall? It's a wall. Sort of like sandbags and stuff? No, it's, or... a, it's a proper wall. Like... There's one? No, it's a brick wall. More like... More like this. Wow. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. That it is. Um, and th then you get terrain where you can hi hide more of your yeah. guys behind. Yeah. And that's what we need, guys. More terrain. Yeah, easier to set up opportunity fire. <laughs> or suppression. <laughs> or suppression. You know, use the tactics. Uh, anyway, let's just uh, run past our list here, see yeah. where we are. Uh, Kickstarters, have we touched upon everything? No. Because you, you were talking about more cards. More yeah. guys. Yeah, but the Kickstarter that was in 2017, we've covered all that. Yeah, I think but, so. But as you said, Kickstarter, yeah. Kickstarter is yet to come. Kickstarter yet to come. Uh, there's going to be a small Kickstarter now in February. Yes, sir. Sort of to test the waters. Mm -hmm. That's going to be cards only. And that is yet again to meet the demand because people are like crying for more characters to play and to yeah. expand. Because 
you need to you need to understand that 148 tactic isn't that big you know so you have yet yeah so you have a lot of players that play exactly the same characters yeah you want to have more versatility you want to choose between more to make them more unique yeah but it takes a lot of time to sculpt the characters yes and to make the models and to manufacture everything it's high quality they're big they look fantastic they're lead free but it takes time to create and have you yeah. know everything checked out uh, and I think he said at one time that may, it, during one year he might be able to release six characters yep. during a whole year but the cards the cards so for February the US Army will get some reinforcement not reinforcements no but they'll get some new cards they get new some cards new blood and this is also some fantastic new stuff but not only the Germans no not only the US the Germans are gonna get new cards as well right uh, not in February not not, not the first Kickstarter no the first one is only for the US yeah. to get them give them more troops so yeah. as we discussed Germans it's, have it's successful more. there will the be Germans more gonna, are gonna get some as well uh, yes maybe then, we'll see some new Russians as well we, a lot of stuff will come so make sure you support that Kickstarter in February yeah. we'll just follow this channel and you will get everything you need to know uh, but the important thing is that there's not characters for Germans but you know what's going to come together with those cards? No. Upgrades, weapons, no. abilities. No. Yes. So you can choose so to have I... a combat shotgun or a BAR. Yeah. And if I want to have Otto with move 6 instead of 5. That's an upgrade you can give? I can give him wow. X advanced physical training card. That's cool. Of course, this costs... That's going to be insane. It costs points to do that. So you will of course increase the cost of your character, so you have to balance it. Yeah. But you know, if that's your way to play, is that how you like to play the game, then nothing's gonna stop you from doing it. So more customizability. More customizability. And oh, imagine Otto with increased movement and a grenade. Or Rupert Schneider with a yeah. semi-auto rifle that can shoot <laughs> two times. Yes, sir. Nice. <laughs> anyway. The coolest thing about this is it's going to be sealed boosters. It's going to be six cards in a booster. They're going to be common, uncommon, and rare cards. And if you support the Kickstarter enough, there's going to be sort of like a pledge where you there's going to be a lot of pledges. Get all the rare cards guaranteed or something. Yeah. There's going to be not that many pledge levels. There's going to be a few pledge levels, but one of them will definitely be the one where you get one of each rare and uncommon card guaranteed. Yeah. The common ones, you know, we, we can't say anything about that. You will get what you get, but uh, all the commons and uncommons, no, all the rare yeah. and uncommon will, will be in that pledge. And I also think uh, Claudio mentioned something about um, having your own character. What? You know, no. there's going to be a pledge where you can kind of chip in a little bit more. Yeah. And you get your own character. Yes, sir. You can choose the name of a character. And maybe even modify the stats. What you want to play, what you want to be. Yeah. Sort of, I think. If you want to be a sniper guy or you want to have a assault rifle or something like that. I, nothing is written in stone, so please <laughs> don't shoot us Check if it does Check out the Kickstarter. Happen. It's gonna air in the end of next month, I think. I, it's going to be February, unless something unexpected happens. Yeah, so As, check, check it out in March. Yeah, or February. <laughs> Whatever comes first. <laughs> uh, so that's that. Yeah. Um, and I think we... Now we have, we have touched upon everything we were supposed to touch upon. Yeah. Uh, but there's something we weren't supposed to touch upon. No. What's that? Because... <laughs> Baueda? Yeah, it's, uh, it's about Baueda. The Baueda and it's about you. And us? Because in 148 Tactic, you can use any sort of model you want, right? You can take other models, as long as they're the same base size. Yeah. You can use, like... We've been playing board games for ages. So, so we have a lot of so We have models. a lot of riflemen. From, from other manufacturers. From other games. Yeah, I'm not going to mention names. But yeah. but we, we do other sort of 
war games. Yeah. And you can use those with those new cards yet to come. And the reinforcement cards and everything. We forgot to say that. We forget to say but the cards you can of course use them with the models you have. Yeah. But that's fantastic. It is. Because you don't have to wait half a year to get one model. And we've been thinking, because we also have a lot of fantasy models. We have a lot of fantasy models? Because we kind of love... We play all sorts of games. Adventure, Dungeons and Dragons stuff, yeah. you know, these things. We love that. So we've been thinking that, why don't we just alter the rules of this game slightly? Or use the rules from this game and add a couple more? Add a couple more, and add some more stuff. And just make a fantasy setting. 148 fantasy? What? Is that something? What? I think this is a Kickstarter to come. Oh, interesting. We've been we've been working on some stuff with the uh, Baweda, of course. We have. And if you guys like fantasy, just stay tuned and more news yet to come. Cool. I love it. Okay. Should we wrap it up? Yeah, let's wrap it up. Okay. So this has been Martin. And this has been Sven. Together we're Tabletop Battle. Yeah. With Joachim and a couple of other guys. Hey Joachim. Hello. And we have now made a video for the 148 Tactic channel on YouTube. So don't uh, mix that with us. We're Tabletop Battle. We got a, a mixed logo here. It's a crossover. Uh, but for this video we have been working for Boera War Games. Yep, yep. For 148 Tactic. Yeah. And presenting some stuff. For that the love going. of the game. For the, we love the game. That's this is why we do it. Uh, and of course this is why we travel to the United Kingdom in yeah. February to hold the tournament. Yeah. Uh, and we're even going to Germany. Yes, we are. In April. To hold the tournament. Red Wolf uh, Convention. In yeah. Germany. It's fifth fifth to sixth April, I think, in Germany. So stay tuned for that as well. So Join the Facebook group for 148. Uh, it's a sort of an official group thing on Facebook. Just yeah. find it. 148 Tactic Official, official Tournament. Yeah. And post your tournaments and we'll see you there.